everyone, welcome to Tea Talk with Ayumi, brewing financial conversations one sip at a time. For today's video, I will be sharing with you guys the top 5 side hustle ideas. So number 1 is freelancing. Freelancing is one of the most flexible way to earn extra while still being committed to your full-time job. So madami ni mga freelance na jobs online. And one of those is, you know, mga video editing, photography, or graphic design, writer, super dami guys, pwede kayong mag-login or kugumuha ng account sa Upwork or sa online jobs, not PH or any online platforms na kung saan kayo makakakuha ng client. But number one tip is make sure to choose your niche. Para alam nyo kung ano yung services na i-offer nyo sa inyong target client or target customers. And make sure na yung niche na napili ninyo is yun talaga yung skill na alam nyo gawin. And sin specialize nyo. And another tip as well is to manage your time of course. Kasi if you know mga side hustle kayo, make sure na you still have your time to rest. And you know, commit to their full-time job. Second is small business. So while working sa in your corporate job or any job that you do full-time, pwede kayo mag-build ng small business. And since you have your co-workers or colleagues, meron kayo mala customers, di ba? Mas madali sa inyo makakuha ng customers. So for small business, pwede kayo mag-start with rebranding. You can start with, I believe, 1,000 to 5,000 pesos. So make sure to set a budget para sa small business ninyo. And number one is to make sure na yung products na ibibenta ninyo is something that you like and something that you're interested para alam nyo kung paano siya i-market. And malay natin that small business magiging malaki siya in the future and it could pay as much or it could you could earn as more than what you're earning sa inyong full-time job it's a stepping stone if gusto niyo talaga like maging big business owner for now you can start with small business kasi mas maganda mag business na meron pa rin ikang secure na income from your full-time job you can also bake maha cookies or muffins sa bahay tas ibenta nyo online or you can sell jewelries or any products na gusto niyong ibenta and I highly suggest na gumawa kayo ng social media about, like, you know, social media account about your brand, about your products, para mas malaki yung target market nyo. That's for small business. Pwede din kayo mag-buy and sell if wala pa kayong, um, di, if hindi pa kayo nakakaipon ng budget para sa capital din nyo, pwede kayo mag-resell. So, hanap kayo ng abibenta, tapos benta nyo din yung products nila, tapos kung may order tubuan nyo lang ng siguro yung pinaka-reasonable din na tubo depende sa product pwede din tayong mag buy and sell that means kailangan din siya ng capital but not that big bilhin na kayo ng products online kung ano yung products na gusto nyo ibenta tapos tubuan nyo lang ng konti then benta nyo sa mahilala nyo and what if meron tayong kotse or motor na nakatambay lang during your free time, you can do deliveries. So, mayo na uso na ang Food Panda, Grab, Shopee, Alazada, or any, you know, mga JNT Express. Uso na ba yun yung mga deliveries? Kasi nga, barami nung nag-order online. Especially after pandemic, mas prefer na na mga tao order online. So, pwede kayo mag-sideline na mag-deliver na mga products. Research nyo lang sa Food Panda or sa Grab or sa JNT na kung paano kayo makaka-deliver. Uh, you don't need to do that full-time. Sa free time, yun lang talaga. So, di ba, you can earn extra while, you know, while we still have your full-time job and at the same time, ma-papakinabangan nyo ang inyong sasakyan or motor or whatever means of transportation you have. Top four is content creation. So, as you guys can see, mar meron na mga vloggers na yun, uh, mga sitat na vloggers that they do that full-time. But since you are just starting and they're just looking for a side hustle, pwede kayo mo simula ng mag 
The modern contents online could be vlogs, um, TikTok videos, Facebook reels, or blog. Like, you know, ang tip ko lang sa inyo. Like every other side hustle, make sure na alam niyo kung ano yung content na gusto niyong ipakita sa audience niyo. Sa inyong target audience could be specifically for travel, uh, beauty vlogs, or cooking content, or lifestyle ba? So, you can research and ko ano yung mapagpilian nyo na gusto niyo gawin at gusto niyo i-share sa mga tao. You can do that. So, sa contemplation, you can earn, of course, uh, views, subscribers, sa sa ads. Sa TikTok, you can do TikTok affiliate. Kung mahilig kayong umorder, then, you know, may ROI, may return of investment. Kung ma- mahilig kayong umorder sa TikTok shop, pwede kayong gumawa ng video about it. And, lagay niyo sa yellow basket. If my order then sa yellow basket nyo, you can earn commissions. So if you guys are interested, if gusto nyo like to know more about TikTok affiliates, please comment in this comment section down below so I can make a video about it, like going in depth on how to do TikTok affiliate. Because I'm also, that's, that's also one of my side hustle. And one last thing that you can do to earn money bansa, the one that I've mentioned earlier, um, you can actually play games while earning extra. So, I highly suggest na bisitahin nyo ang www.gameape.cc. They have hundreds of games to enjoy, and you guys can earn at the same time. So again, that's www.gameape.cc. Make sure to visit their site. And tignan nyo yung mga games na meron sila available for you guys to enjoy and earn extra. Stop.